Well, it's a, it's, it's a fantastic moment. We've uh, been waiting here uh, at the agency for eight years. The federal government's support of this area will be seen as something that is going to be a continuous uh, uh, benefit and flow. And if they purchase these, these uh, bonds that, that help us uh, get our cash flow you know, back on track, then, uh, th then I think this will be, this will be a tremendous uh, opportunity for us. Now, those embryos will be discarded or destroyed anyway. And so I think the argument that we could use that for benefit of, of patients rather than just simply destroying them uh, or discarding them I think is a strong logical argument and, and I think in a humanitarian sense it would be very difficult to, to, to say that this was, this was not a benefit to the community. But I think over the next uh, five to ten years the revolution will have happened in, cell, in, in, in stem cell therapeutics and, and we, we already know that there are new molecules now arising from the experimental work. These are drugs that would or, or molecules uh, which would never been discovered uh, if we hadn't had the embryonic stem cells uh, available in the laboratories.